Hi everybody, I've just unloaded the kiln, um, I had a raw glaze firing yesterday, it went quite well so I've been raw glaze firing these, well I've been raw glazing these, I'll be firing them later. Um, these have all got my Temaku on the inside, um, these little jugs, I'm going to just blow some ash on those and these I'm going to dip again in a glaze that I made up that just consists of, um, just find it, it's only three ingredients, board clay, china clay and wood ash and it gives you this nice matte glaze. So nice and cheap I can put on my functional way and see if it sells. Actually quite like it, it seems to, to break in places where it's raised up so if I do some scraffito and try it on that. Um, yeah, these are the pieces that I unloaded from a raw firing yesterday. Got some yarn bowls, this is the Temaku that I've just used. I think they're going to be more practical than these ones, but they're a bit prettier. <laughs> my Temaku again, I'm trying to get through my Temaku to, to try another ingredient. Ingredients, Temaku. But that fired quite nice. The Feldspar swipes. This is me messing about with a, an Ilmenite wash just with a clear glaze over the top. I think I need to thicken the Ilmenite up a bit. Um, yeah, jug, just with blown ash on. And bird feeders here that I'm raw glazing as well at the moment. So, <laughs> I'll let you know how I get on with another raw glaze firing. That's just ash again. Um, despite what people think, I'm not actually copying anybody else. I'm just um, potting on a budget so if I can get some nice results just with ash that I'm actually being given at the moment that's all well and good as far as I'm concerned yeah still waiting for some more kiln bricks so I can hopefully build it a bit higher get some bigger pots thrown okay everybody bye for now <laughs>